Okay, so it's day, I have no idea of the quarantine of 2020, um, but let's talk it out. <laughs> Welcome to my channel and welcome to my journey to stardom vlog. You know, I, we're in the middle of the coronavirus quarantine right now. It's the year 2020. I'm saying that because I know YouTube lasts for like a very long time, right? Things are forever. Um, and you know, I had an idea to start a vlog. Was it last year or the year before? Maybe 2017, 2018? I don't remember. You know, I've been super busy. Um, if you're a subscribe to this channel, which if you're not, please subscribe. And don't just subscribe, subscribe and turn on the uh, notifications. Um, if you hear snoring, that is <laughs> my dog, Prince. <laughs> I'm out here with Prince here at uh, Chatsworth Park. Oh, feels good to be outside. It's a little chilly. Um, uh, just got done with an amazing uh, two-hour panel summit, virtual summit, with some amazing co coaches and thought leaders in my industry. As you can see, Prince is walking me. <laughs> uh, what do you all think about having individual clips forecasting to see you in, in different ways. Um, by individual clips, I mean actually shooting new high quality material that is not on your reel. Anybody wanna take that one? I think that's a great idea. I mean, anything you need to do to retrain, because we're human. So I just meet you, I meet Wendy, I meet James, like, yeah, got your vibe, yeah, put you in that box, right? That's just natural, because we, we all have something that comes easily without us even trying. Like, but it can be as simple as, like you said, for women, we can change our hair, take new headshots, and, and having a mix of really just helping me to totally erase what I've known, I think the best thing to do is show me something new because it could just be there. But at the end of the day, we all are solutions to casting's problem, right? So we, I'm looking for the quickest solution to my problem. Ba uh, mobster, got it. Uh, thug, got it. Yeah, quick. Of course you you can do more. There's more depth there, but now you're gonna have to show me and train because I'm time is money. I gotta cast this thing quick and I don't have time to think about what your deepest desires are. But if you show me, I might, I mean, seriously, I, you know, we, we have gigs to fill, but I think that's a great idea. And that way you can present that and be like, oh, it'll give them something new to think about. Great. Oh man. And it was just, it was so lovely just to connect with so many artists from around the world, so many actors and just to connect and, and, and know that we're not alone. You know, we're in the middle of this uh, self-quarantine and uh, one of the coaches, James Wagner, he said something today that just was just helpful, like in re, re, rethinking how we deal with it and not even calling it quarantine and calling it a home retreat. Like we are retreating, we are at home. And it just, just changed the, the perspective of it, you know? and. Because quarantine just sounds so harsh, you know, and we know everything is serious. So anyway, we just got done with that. And I'm just feeling really full and grateful. You know, I didn't start coaching actors until I moved back to L.A. in 2017. And I wasn't even immediately. Um, I started a video series called Actors Daily Bread. Um, episodes for that come out on Wednesdays here on this channel. But it just turned into this community in my in this movement called Hollywood Bound Actors. And I just think about the power that is in showing up. Showing up when you're uncertain, showing up when you don't even know what you're supposed to talk about. <laughs> you know, you never know whose lives can be changed or impacted just by your presence. So just my word for you today, something I'm thinking about is I walk Prince or he walks me. <laughs> he was so good, he did it. Prince, honey, Prince. He's like, lady, I don't care about these. I want to smell pee. Why don't you just let me be? <laughs> All right, let me go. You know, I've had the amazing honor to start.
start coaching actors from around the world and I have had been doing my show as you will see here on this channel actors daily bread I've been doing that for oh my gosh as of the, as of this recording we have there are 220 episodes here on YouTube um, and so I've been here and I've been connecting to my audience and and I was just like you know I get so many questions that I can't always answer in a quick 10 minute live or 30 minute Facebook live and and I've had many requests people want to know more I think we're just all curious we live in a world in a day and age of um, reality TV shows and all kinds of things online you know so I figured I would try this I would come back I had this idea for this vlog and again I'm just using it as public accountability you can get some insight on my day I don't know you may not find it interesting you might find it hella interesting I don't know but welcome um, and I will say this you know I think this vlog is important too for whatever I'm gonna show who knows I'm like lifting that up a little bit I got this lovely Buddha photo uh, picture up there that I really love this is my meditation nook um, and it's always so nice to sit here and I have to be honest since all of this stuff with coronavirus and the quarantine I haven't spent as much time here as I feel like I would like to I know y'all are so over me moving this camera it just looks crooked every time and because I keep moving it I'm gonna get it right for next time <laughs> I'm gonna get it right for next time. Listen, you know, I am I believe in just going for it and just uh, trying. Fail, succeed, just give it a try. Um, so I'm here and if you have questions and if, um, if I don't feel like it's too personal, I'll answer it. So leave a comment below and uh, let me know what you're curious about. You know, I think a big thing I wanna shed light on is like certainly, I may not be famous to the world, <laughs> the entire world but I know that I'm a household name and in, in for many in, in many people's houses a lot of my clients and their families and their spouses and their kids and um, something that I wish I had that I wish I knew before really pursuing acting full-time and now I am you know doing that but I remember being at my day jobs day job night job years ago and thinking that, oh, you know, when I get that, when I get that guest star, oh, I'm gonna be set. Oh, I'm gonna be recurring, I'm gonna be set. And I just wish someone would have been real with me and told me, no boo, <laughs> that'll pay a bill. <laughs> You're not gonna be set, you know? And not to be negative Nancy, but just to shed some light on the reality. Because as I'm understanding now, which you'll probably see as you take this journey with me, there are times when I have to make it look like I have it all together. I have to show up to that red carpet even if I, it was my last dime or if I had to rent the dress or you know had to get hair and makeup and still just had to show up and, and put on a good face. And you know certainly, of course, like all of us, we're entitled to our privacy. So I will never share anything that I don't, that I don't feel like is beneficial to you. But I think it's important that you see that too. Because I know I have so many clients from all over and they're like, Christine, one day I'm gonna be like you and one day this. And I love that I inspire people. I love that if you're watching and if I've inspired you in any way, I'm so grateful for that. But I also just wanna make sure, you know, something <laughs> a lot of people will say to me, which I, I take as a compliment, but I always also find it funny. Um, People say, oh my gosh, Christine, I heard you talk on such and such interview or on this podcast or I watched your show or I took, I, you know, I hired you for this fast track session or I coached with you in your inner circle. And like, you just keep it so real. You're just so real, like tough love. You're so real. And my question is, is like, what is everybody else doing? Is everybody else being fake? Is everybody else just shooting, you know, smoke up your butt? Like, I just don't even... I just don't even know how else to be. Maybe it's the Sagittarius in me that's very direct and straightforward, but I try to always come from a place of love and 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 helping people accelerate in their life. 
because someone did some many people did that for me so I just find it interesting where people are saying you're so real so I'm my goal also is just to um, be candid with you and um, and pray that you get the lesson from it ahead of time so you don't have to bump your head as many times as I did. I mean, honestly. So, this vlog, I know this is going long, but this may just be moments of me rambling. And listen, I didn't watch many a YouTube show where people ramble, so I'm like, just if you ramble, girl, just ramble. <laughs> because, you know, I try to keep my other shows pretty succinct and, um, so you get the you get the meat, you get on about your day. But I figure, hey, if you're gonna tune into the vlog, you can get to know Christine on a whole different level. Um, this is an interesting time for me uh, with the quarantine. You know, it's just a lot. It's a lot, and so I process, but I I try to be the light. I try to be the light, the lighthouse. For myself, for my dog, for my friends, for my students, and for the world. So I encourage you to just try to be the light no matter how small and insignificant it may seem. So I will see you. Uh, there will be new vlogs on Thursdays. And I might, depending on how I feel, what's going on, there might be more. But at least on that day. And be sure, again, to hit subscribe and turn on notifications. The buttons are below so you don't miss anything. We have um, Tuesdays is Actors Daily Bread. Thursdays is this vlog. And on Sunday, we have um, Sunday Stories where I'm just gonna share some fun anecdotes of being on set. <laughs> I'm laughing because I already have some ideas in my head. Some embarrassing stories, some inspiring stories. Um, so yeah, that should be fun. So be sure you tune in for that as well. So thank you for being here. Thank you for letting me be a part of your life. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Bye. Hey you, are you an actor? Not booking. Well, guess what? The problem isn't you. It's not that you're not talented, hardworking, or deserving. It's that you haven't found the missing link that can change your career forever. Playing small. The Actor's Guide to Becoming a Booking Magnet. It's my new book! You can order it now at whyplaysmall.com.